Ladies and gentlemen, Homeworld Free Multiplayer. I have made so many attempts trying to record a game, but uh, honestly, none of them were good enough. So here we are on attempt number infinity. I think this is the one. I think this is the one that's actually worth your time watching. Um, my opponent here has done a little bit of practice now, uh, played against my strat. Now, let's start to discuss what the game is about a little bit first. Um, you can, you've probably seen if you watch some campaign gameplay or just uh, others doing multiplayer that the game is quite spammy. You've got all these different production queues uh, that you gotta keep cycling so that you can spend your resources. Um, there's only one resource type and we're starting the game off right away with just making a ton of these resource controllers. And I like spreading them out because while that leaves them vulnerable, uh, it also means that they don't just gobble up the resources um, immediately, essentially, in the early game. I've got two more left, so once these guys start really gathering, which is going to be in just a moment, so many resources are going to come in. And th this is why we're going to start immediately uh, making recons and interceptors. And I just give it one moment. If this number starts going up, I'll immediately be clicking the Strikecraft whole upgrade. There it is. Uh, resources are now coming in. And we're also going to start researching railgun corvettes and fleet bombers. Suddenly, our income has absolutely ballooned. Um, and although our opponent is outspamming us a little bit in the early game in terms of numbers, as far as I can see with this uh, probe over there. I think my workers are more spread out, so those are very focused, which means there will be a long amount of time they'll be migrating. That will be the weakness of our opponent who are going to try to catch those off guard Attention. with a bunch of bombers while we tech up our entire fleet. Um, oh, one of my workers is actually uh, not working. <laughs> that will make it not a worker. Moving on target. Right. Where did we put you? Down there. Alright, everybody will be spread out. We still got a lot of income. Holy. Okay, let's start spending all those resources. I'm gonna get the free upgrades for um, the fighters. I'm gonna get the last harvester as well. Our probe has been shot down, so we're gonna not select all three of these. The game really likes to turn a single click into a double click. If you click something multiple times in... Group one, uh, group short succession. Game is made for boomers, guys. You can't click something twice in the space of 10 seconds. Otherwise, it's a double click. Anyway, with that complaint out of the way, I think let's open up the combat. So, one of the most important things to do is to set the cross formation. Uh, default hotkey is Shift F3. So do remember that one. Uh, in the cross formation, they assume this shape and most of your fighters will be, in fact, fighting. That's pretty important if you're a fighter. Understood. I'm sure you guys can imagine why. Now let's start spamming a bunch of railgun corvettes at the same time, get the assault frigates going. This... Uh, I, th I thought I already clicked that. We want to get some anti strikecraft turrets on the ground as well and actually lower the... Standby. Mothership a little bit further down to maximize our overall cover. Um, we're gonna separate these guys and make sure that the interceptors are set to high firepower. Meanwhile, the bombers are gonna go about their business. And I think our opponent has also learned that indeed the uh, cross formation is the superior formation. I, I think it's even true for the bombers for the most part. Group one, um, we should be able to spam some more units. Research level two is almost done for our Strikecraft. Let's get level three next. Uh, very early in the game, but we're already doing that. Very important to do, of course. Uh, this guy I completely forgot about. Let's just send him to the side there. Uh, Mothership does need some kind of cover, so these fresh units coming out will be doing exactly that. But meanwhile, the bombers are picking off some important targets they're among the resource collectors so we're already getting a little bit of an advantage and once they're done there i'm gonna cloak them and go after those other collectors on the side hopefully i will remember everything um the opponent spam is looking very equal to mine now so good job with the macro there uh let's get the heavy torpedo turrets and the 
anti strikecraft ones on the ground here, well, on the ice. Alright, I do not want to be uh, picked off here. These bombers are valuable, but there are some free picks with those co co controllers, so let's go after them. Uh, they're even down there, so very low chance of uh, anything chasing me through here. We've got the uh, railgun upgrade. Oh no, don't shoot, don't shoot, don't shoot, don't shoot. Shoot this. They are so powerful with this burst attack. Look at that resource controller just essentially disappearing. We're gonna take the weak ones and dock them. Um, plenty of other strike craft are out as well now. And let's put them in the control group. Uh, we've got some of these platforms showing up and we're gonna plant them down there. We're gonna go even lower with the mothership because I wanna be in the range of that. A uh, little bit of micro with the strike craft you can do is turn them around quickly in these fights to go after uh, the others instead of going long distance dog fighting. Oh, this worked out beautifully. So the they are sending railgun corvettes after, but uh, I'm not sure our opponent is aware the bombers actually counter the corvettes in this game, unlike in the other homeworld games. So that's a pretty big deal. We're gonna get some free pickoffs. And we're certainly going to capitalize on that. The speaker of capitals, assault frigates are right for construction. We're gonna get ion cannon frigates, support frigates, torpedo frigates, all the whole thing because we can afford it. We are on eight collectors after all. However, we are under attack, so I wanna see what exactly is going on. It's not bombers, so I'm pretty chill about it. At least for the moment. Um let's see if we can uh do a little bit of micro here with these guys and pick Oh my god! All right, let's get out of the range of these turrets, because that is nasty business. Tell you what, I'm just gonna dock these. I'm, I'm just gonna dock these. Let's let's get out of the way with the mama ship. Um, looks like our bombers are being picked off after all, but I mean, I did trade into railgun corvettes. I'm gonna remake them. Let's get some more bombers. Um, if, if he's happy chilling here. That's fine. I'm, I'm surprised that the Corvettes actually took him out so well. Group Good stuff. Good for our opponent. Not for me. Ready for action. Um, we're gonna deploy more of these. Did I forget to make heavy torpedo turrets? Yes, I did indeed. Uh, but the Assault Frigates are finishing up. Let's get more Corvettes ourselves. We have the uh, Tier 3. Strikecraft, so that's pretty good for us. Uh, we've got the first two assault frigates, so let's focus those on the uh, corvettes here. And this is gonna be our next target indeed. So the bombers, I think, have a pretty good target. Uh, I'm gonna leave the assault frigates alone. Let's just pick off these and. Um, Hopefully they can manage it. Like the assault frigates have some really good armor. I, I think they can take it. Let's get the armor upgrade for them. Speaking of, as well as the ion frigate um, beam burn mode thing, uh, as well as some support frigates. Now, I'm happy with where I am, but we have so much money. Let's get some carriers. Then we've got all these. Look at that! Look at that massive fleet. That is looking so good. Uh, I'm gonna take the bombers out of this and the railgun corvettes of course to pick off a resource controller if we can uh, fix our control groups a bit there we go those strike craft will absolutely annihilate the corvettes and we got from long distance we can pick off pretty much everything uh, I've been forgetting to deploy my turrets here by the mother ship Watch group two. There's assault frigate ready for action. And I think our opponent doesn't have all that much stuff Enemy left here. Four. So let's take off those, uh, take out those um, turret emplacements because they're hella annoying. And otherwise, just go after these controllers because yeah, these turrets are wrecking me, man. They're wrecking me. Uh, the frigates are coming out, so that's good stuff. Um, I will prefer ion frigates and torpedo frigates over. Uh, assault frigates from here on uh, because I just need the firepower for taking out this mothership before it pops out some crazy business. I'm assuming something is docked in there, which actually is displayed in this game. We've also got some support frigates, so uh, we're in a very good position here. I think we might be able to finish this. Don't have too many corvettes, but I'm not sure we need them. 
They're doing a good enough job here taking down the resource controllers together with the bombers. So massive reduction in our opponent's uh, overall economy income. Another turret to deploy. One of our Corvette, uh, one of our collectors is under attack, but it's gonna be fine. I think we're running out of resources, indeed. So we're gonna want to move on with both of these to some better spots. Unfortunately, you can't. <coughs> Excuse me. Um, unfortunately, you can't see them on the map, so you can't directly interact. We'll just have to send them manually. That's fine. Um, you can obviously see that I'm not getting enough resources to keep up with all this production <laughs> um, we're gonna cancel the bombers we don't need them okay do we just ah we just shoot down the ship mama ship still just focus it um assault frigates don't have a damage ability but the ion frigates drew do i've researched it let's get a nice shot in oh boy Oh boy, <laughs> that's a lot of firepower. Uh, we've got a lot of Strikecraft idol, and this should be GG. Definitely one of the better games I've had. Um, there's a lot of beginner players, obviously, so early on in the game's life. And we're gonna have a very fast boom. Make sure to like and subscribe, ladies and gentlemen. And I might be back with some more, although I will say it's a bit m monotonous. I do hope. Uh, the game is going to get some updates to, uh, you know, improve the strategic aspect a bit. See you around.